Hey guys and welcome to episode 6 of Baking with Q. Today I'm going to show you my homemade red velvet cake recipe. You will need 3 and a 3 quarters cup of self rising flour, 2 and a quarter cups of sugar, 3 eggs, 1 and a half teaspoons of vanilla, 1 and a half teaspoons of vinegar, 1 and a half teaspoons of baking powder, 1 and a half teaspoons of cocoa powder, 2 and a quarter cups of oil, 1 and a half cup of buttermilk, 3 ounces of red food coloring, or 6 tablespoons. You're going to want to preheat your oven to 350 degrees. I third this recipe because the full recipe makes 3 9 inch or 8 inch cake pans. So let's get started by sifting your dry ingredients. Okay, that's perfect. I wanted to let you know that I am including my sugar as a dry ingredient. I have my egg and my vanilla together. I have my oil by itself, my buttermilk by itself, and I have my vinegar by itself. Everything else is in the dry ingredients. So now what you're going to do is you're going to add in your buttermilk. your oil and you're also going to add in your other ingredients like your egg and your vanilla and you're also going to want to add in your vinegar So now what you're going to want to do is cream that together just until a batter forms. Okay, that's perfect. So now what I'm going to do is add in my red food coloring just until I get to nice lovely red color. Okay, so that's not quite red enough. I'm going to add a little bit more in. And I'm going to stir that until it gets nice and red. So I'm going to keep adding my red for the coloring until it gets really nice and red and bright. Just to let you know, this will darken in the oven and get more colorful. So don't add too much red for the coloring. Okay, that's perfect. So now, I'm going to go ahead and show you how to fill your cake pan. Okay, now I'm going to show you how to fill your cake pan. You're going to take your batter. I already pre-greased and floured my pan. You're just going to pour your batter into the pan like this. Okay, we're back. We filled our cake pan and now we're going to put it into the oven for 45 minutes to an hour.